The Lace Hour here with I'm Third Movement. I want to bring a video to you guys. I want to talk about, um, as you can see in the picture, or maybe you can't see, I have to see at the end of it when I do the editing. But it should show you that it says that we want to invite people to, to not the church, but to Jesus, right? And I want to take off with that um, to give you a little understanding of, of, of what the church should be, right? Not Because what we have today is not where the church should be, I don't think. And who am I? You know, I, I just pray and, and hope that, you know, I, I stay right. But, okay, we go back to, to Matthew 2, um, 24 in the first, um, the first verse, right? It's, it's, it's the disciples. They are looking at a building. And, and they're marveling, and they, they're telling Jesus, look, look at this building, look how, look how amazing this building, building is. I don't know if they thought they would be leaders in, those, in one of those. Maybe they thought they'd have a, a great temple or something. I, I don't know, I don't know. But Jesus was like, no, 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 no. I tell you, at the end, this is not going to stand. None of these rocks, all this beauty stuff is going to stand. And I got a lot of videos talking about our beautiful cathedrals. Our beautiful temples, our beautiful churches. We have some of the most beautiful churches in the world, in America. We have some amazing churches. I, I, can't, I cannot lie. We have some beautiful churches. But it seems like the more out of the better our church is getting, the worse the people are getting because we're never meant. We were never meant to serve a church. We were never. What I mean by that is, we never meant to serve an organization. We were never meant to serve a, a building. We were meant to 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 go to 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 live out what a church should be. We were we were made to live out church by how I treat my brother, right? How I treat my neighbor. When 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 I see somebody in in, in need, we were to give. And I don't think that our church in America is that anymore. And I think we're living in a false church. And, 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 and I'm not afraid of what's going to happen because I know God is in control. But for people who, who are looking for, for, for Jesus, for people who are looking for a great rep representation of Jesus, and they have to come to a, 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 the American church, I am afraid that they will not find what they're looking for other than the Holy Spirit coming in and taking over, which He will, and I, and I find joy in that. So, here's the deal. Look at church history, right? So, it was around Constantine's reign. where Because before Constantine and right after Jesus, that little period, um, we can say from, um, from, from, from the birth of Jesus, and then, okay, we say what well, Jesus died in, uh, at 33, so 33 A.D. to the reign of Constantine, about 200 to 300 years, we have the church being done, like people, like, come on, um, Stephen was stoned. That's the kind of thing that we had. We had Stephen being stoned. Anybody who brought out their faith in Christ got, got, got murdered, but it was still growing. And it was not growing inside four walls, right? It was spreading. It was spreading like a virus. It was just, it was just going everywhere. And they left the four walls, and the focus was never the church. Now, people question why, what was the reason that Constantine... Um, said, okay, um, we're gonna, we're gonna, we're gonna make a day of worship because he, he, he convinced, he, he confessed to be a Christian, but some people say he didn't live a life of a Christian. We have a lot of that going on right now. But Constantine said, okay, we're gonna have a day of worship. Now, when, when he did that, that was good for three reasons. The first reason was because it gave Christians a, 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 a way to come out. Okay, now it's cool to be a Christian. Now, the world gravitates Christianity. I'm not saying gravitates Jesus, but Christianity. And then it gave the slaves in that day a day off because they took Sundays off, so everybody took a day off. So it gave the slaves a day a day off. And I think with people, the third reason with people 
being more inclined to 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 a leader being Christian, they more inclined to hear the gospel. Now, whether I believe the gospel is gonna get out there no matter what, I I, I think that God will use people. Um, this video is ending, so I'm gonna do a part two. They saw one third movement.